uh, one of the harder concerts to get the word out about. Yes. About which to get the word. I don't know. Yeah. Um, uh, because the, the, the group is voluntary. Um, the groups are voluntary, I should say, and they meet in the mornings. Um, and there aren't as many students in it uh, as in the, the band and the orchestras and the choirs and all that kind of stuff. Um, but you guys are in for a big treat because this is one of the, the most unique standard film um, uh, concerts that we do all year. It's kind of like a pop concert, but maybe more of a, an upper crest pop concert. <laughs> and we also have a wonderful guest star every year, and this year it's Jeannie Geiger. <laughs> I saw Jeannie playing with uh, the Tommy Igo uh, cons group conspiracy at Yoshi's, which I highly recommend. It's a lot of fun. And she got up playing the trombone, and I was like, I need to contact her because that was so fun. I, I, she, she just injects the groups that she plays with with a lot of energy, and, uh, and it's, it's really neat to have her here. So thank you for agreeing to do that. Then after we, uh, we sort of talked for a little bit, it turns out we went to the same college for our undergrad at about the same time that I was in the orchestra and she was in the jazz world. So we didn't really cross paths that <laughs> often. <laughs> but it's pretty cool. We know some of the same people, which is kind of fun. So, small world, small Bay Area world, but uh, this is very exciting. So this group meets once a week in the mornings, it's an introduction, uh, introduction to jazz, and we learn some jazz standards, some simple tunes, and then how to uh, improvise, which of course starts with quoting little bits of the melody which you might hear, and also knowing a few scales that might work with, um, with the chords that we're playing. So, uh, it's kind of a, a challenging thing to do at this age, especially when you're only doing it once a week. But all these students are involved in band or orchestra or something else as well, uh, um, if, whenever possible. So, um, our next two, Channel of Island.
recognize this next one from the Enchantment Under the Sea dance in um, Back to the Future. <laughs> 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 I, well, I was like, oh, I need another tune. Oh, yeah.
is made up still of anything that wants to be part of jazz. Because I think every, especially right now, it's important for everybody to understand how to improvise. Um, as classical music starts to branch out a lot more into including a lot more jazz type things, improvisatory things, and hip hop things, even people who work in orchestras sometimes are asked to play in styles that they never thought they would have to play in. Uh, in order to be part of, a, of an orchestra. So I think it's great for everybody to be able to improvise. Um, that would be jam band. And then big band typically uh, is, is trombones, trumpets, and saxophones, because it is written for that. And then, of course, a rhythm section. Um, so people like um, our clarinet and our flutes, I sometimes recommend if they feel like they'd like to play with the big band, they will sometimes also pick up the saxophone, which is perfectly normal uh, doubling. It's, it's not odd at all, and, it, and it's a very simple thing to, to do. But they don't have to. I mean, you can always just keep playing your, your flute and clarinet and all that in the, uh, in the jam band. So um, our final tune is Iron Man by Black Sabbath. <laughs> 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 um, and before we finish up, I just wanted to thank um, Brian Kremler who came in. I don't know if he's that guy. We kind of looked for you before the lights went down, but uh, he came in several times um, to work with the this group. Um, he's a sax player. He came in. Uh, true, except that actually, and he uh, our bass player stepped in, and he he came in and kind of worked with the kids and talked about soloing and stuff. And, uh, which is really cool, so thank you to him. <laughs> All right, here we go. Iron Man. Uh. 